It's been more than three years since there's been any lights on the 210 bridge in Lake Charles. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Agnes Durowa. The lights were damaged in the 2020 storms, but what's the holdup on getting them replaced? KPLC's Andrea Robinson has the latest. These lights once lined the 210 bridge, but now there's talks of replacement. These poles will be stronger. They're going to be uh, steel poles. Um, the poles will actually also not be as high as the previous poles. In addition to that, the, the lights will be uh, LED lights as well. John Guidra with DOTD explains that these upgrades are not only to improve the path for drivers, but to also have them more resilient when it comes to the next storm. It's going to be a better you know, situation for the drivers as far as lighting and, and structural safety of the, the poles. But better may mean drivers are going to have to wait longer as the project was originally planned for 2022. So why the delay? The, they were double the estimated costs. Um, it required a new project, which re then requires all of that bid process to start over again. The project is estimated to cost seven to eight million dollars, but that number could change once a bid is approved. Just the cost of materials has gone up. That's, you know, it all plays into the, the cost of any kind of any project, but especially large infrastructure projects like this. In Lake Charles, Andrea Robinson, 7 News. DOTD says a timeline for the project is undetermined, but it's expected to come to fruition in the next couple of years.